Hey there, this is Tyler Delaney from the Julie Kinnear team and I wanted to talk to you today about pre-construction condos as an investment. Uh, this used to be a very um, lucrative and uh, popular investment strategy uh, in terms of real estate. Uh, a few years ago um, when you could find pre-construction prices that were significantly less uh, on a price per square foot basis than you could find uh, in resale condos, so existing condos. Um, nowadays, uh, it seems that a lot of developers are uh, pricing their, their units, these pre-construction units, uh, ahead of the curve. They're speculating uh, as to the future value of these condos uh, when they're going to be finished. And um, as we all know, speculation is, uh, is, is not a, uh, a great strategy to employ. Um, we've had a very strong condo market the past few years and uh, a lot of de developers are, are very um, uh, bullish on, uh, on, on the way that prices um, are expected to continue. So uh, they're pricing their units as if uh, these units already existed and as if they were in the market uh, in a couple of years from now in terms of uh, prices. You know, um, I've seen places selling units for 14, 1600 square foot. And, uh, and these are pre-construction prices, which is just outlandish. It's crazy. Um, based on, on current prices, uh, but people are still buying them. Uh, I, I don't know, um, you know, maybe people are speculating in the same way and, and believe the market will continue to go up in the same way it has the past few years, but uh, I just think that's a really risky investment right now. I'm not, uh, you know, saying that uh, you shouldn't buy pre-construction condos. I think, you know, you have to look at each development on a case-by-case -case basis. Uh, you know, go with your realtor uh, to, uh, to check out the sales office, see what the prices are like, see what's being offered, and, uh, and compare uh, what you find there on a price per square foot basis with what exists in a comparable uh, resale condo, something that does exist. Compare the prices there. You really should be getting a bit of a discount when you're buying pre-construction. Otherwise, why not just go and buy that existing condo, something that you can see and feel and touch. Uh, the risk inherent in buying from plans uh, used to come with that discount of, um, you know, to, to compensate for that risk. And, and now it seems that you're actually paying a premium to buy off plans, which in my main mind just doesn't make sense. So as I said, you know, go to these sales offices uh, with your realtor. We'd love to help you. Uh, you know, I am experienced. We are experienced in, in uh, working with uh, these developers and, uh, and working with the contracts. There's a lot that goes into these contracts that you should know about. So uh, take your time, look at uh, these projects on a case-by-case -case basis and, and make a smart measured decision uh, with all the information. Uh, so that's the tip for today. I uh, hope that's helpful and uh, I'll see you soon.